Hi there, Jungle Laurie here with another shave. Today is Mesothelioma Awareness Day. Oh, that was a bit hard to say, but anyway. So we're gonna do a blue shave in recognition of this day. One of our fellow enthusiasts, Kim Gray, is battling mesothelioma. She's got a particular form of it called uh, peritoneal tonneal mesothelioma, which is a cancer of the abdomen. So we'll start off. I've got a brush, nice and blue. The blue brush from um, Shave by Dave. I call it the rock pool. see well you probably can't see but it's a blue sparkly handle with a cashmere knot in it 26 mil so i'll just put that in the soak while we um, do the preparation i do appreciate appreciate i've got a blue shirt on as well blue hat Mesothelioma is a, a quite a rare cancer. It's associated with um, being in, uh, exposed to asbestos. It's not the same as asbestosis. Asbestosis is not a cancer. There's only about, uh, in Australia, about 800 cases a year diagnosed. When you compare that to um, about 14,000 lung cancers a year in Australia. Oh, what we're using to um, for pre-shave today is Nivea. It's blue. Body shaving stick. I'll just put a bit of that on. This is my pre-shave. I've said it before, you can use anything for pre-shave. You can use shaving soaps, creams. Glycerin soaps. This is quite... She's quite slick. It's got a nice, pleasant scent, manly scent to it. Right, well, that's doing its job. The soap we're going to use today is Blue Devil. Of course, in Australia, what else should you use for a blue day but Blue Devil? And I've got the blue logo from frankincense. Frankincense, it's good medium strength. It starts off with that um, classic frankincense, uh, sort of earthy smell. And when you lather it up, um, the uh, undertones of the citrus that he has in the blend come forward a bit more. Right, well, um, We'll swap to the other camera to uh, show the leathering, then we'll come back to the main camera again. Cheers!
Alright, back from the leathering. So we got a nice leather as we normally get from Blue Devil. Quite easy to leather up. I don't know whether you can see the shine in it. It's very hard to show on the camera. Alright. Just with the the pre-shave again. Oh, this is going to be a good pre shape as you expect from HM. Yeah. Expect from a, a soap, a, a shaving soap, that is. Oh, we'll put this on. a bit, won't matter, got plenty. Right, back to mesothelioma. Mesothelioma in America is rare as well. They have about 3,000 cases. Diagnosed every year compared to 220,000 lung cancer. So, uh, you can see it's quite rare. And the form that Kim Gray has, which is a uh, Cancer of the abdomen, abdomen, the stomach. <laughs> um, there's only about 500 cases a year diagnosed, so it's a very rare form of cancer. All right, that's lovely. Right, the razor we're using today. Put a bit on my fingers. Here's a uh, blue handled EJA 89 clone. It's a clone, it's not actually the uh, Mega Jagger. But it's got a lovely blue handle on it, so we're going with that one. And it's got a um, Gillette, brand new Gillette Silver Blue Blade in there. So the first shave. Warm the head up. This is a very mild razor. It is cutting now. It's about the same as the King G Gillette. Now there's no overhang to worry about. first pass didn't knock down a lot it's a bit mild for that this razor oh man <laughs> it could be skipping over because of it so much splitness it's all right 
We'll get it out. I won't put as much on on the second layer. Down a bit better. first pass, but second pass, much better. It's not a bad way to raise it, I think it's about 80 grams uh, from memory. I picked it up off um, Amazon Australia. For about sixteen dollars, if I remember, I bought it because I like the blue handle. <laughs> that was the only reason. Plus, it was cheap. I oh, said, can't go wrong. I can use the blue handle if I don't use the head. Wouldn't be the first time I've thrown away a head just to get the handle. These, uh, some of these cheap Chinese heads are not that good. Alright, we'll go on another pass. Yeah, the leather's giving off a nice scent, light to medium, which is what we normally get from Blue Devil. Plenteous lead here. You you don't need as much, even as much as half a teaspoon. I haven't tried it with quarter teaspoon. And I reckon you could probably go a quarter teaspoon. Oh, well, anyway, about two grams, less than half a teaspoon, anyway. Alright, against the grain. Oh yes, that's alright. At least three passes with this razor. Very very much in the light in the vein of the King C Gillette. Could even be milder, I don't know. Hard to say if they're doing them side by side. The same blade.
Very nice. Right, so I'll feel around. Uh, just a few touch ups here and there. Oh, lovely feel on the skin, as we expect from uh, Blue Devil. Plenty of residual. I could do the touch ups on residual, but I've got plenty of soap. And uh, we'll just put a bit around. Plenty of leather. I'll just show you. Uh, I've got another shave worth of soap. No, oh, leather left over, sorry. It's a very safe razor. Not likely to get damaged with this one. If you shave, you can always get cut by any razor, of course. There's a sharp blade in it. That'll do. It's a lovely shave. Very smooth. Very smooth. It's, it's not super close, so it's a damn fine shave, but not a, not a BBS. It's pretty hard to get BBS with that razor. All right. Um, I'll just put this um, on my face and I'll go and have my shower and we'll come back for the post shave and a review or post mortem. Hi, I'm back from the shower. Very nice shave. Not super close, but a damn fine shave. No weebus, creepers, dreepers, or whatever. Um, so we'll put on my Post shave. I've got a bit of witch hazel from T. N. Dickinson's in a blue bottle, a blue label anyway. It's just a standard witch hazel. I'll put a little bit of. Mental in it. I can put a bit more in it. I guess I can feel the, the coolness of the menthol now. I sh shake up my balm. We're going with the Nivea balm. Two and one bar. Instead of my normal lucky tiger.
Nice, very nice. Let that get absorbed for a while. Put the top back on. Alright, while that's getting absorbed, we'll go over the, um, the products we used in the shave. We used the brush we used was the uh, Rock Pool from Shave by Dave with a 26mm cashmere knot. Went blank there for a second, which is pretty normal for me. The soap we used was Blue Devil Shave Co. Frankincense. It's a lovely scent of frankincense. Um, mixed with uh, orange and lemon and bergamot and a bit of yin yang, I believe, from memory. Um, what else do we use? We used the pre shave, we used was a Nivea stick, body shaving stick. That's pretty slick stuff. <laughs> Not that we needed that much slickness added. And I think, oh, the razor. The razor we used was the blue handled EJ89 clone. Very mild razor, this one. Normally I'll put a, uh, an extra sharp blade in that one, but I'm using the Gillette Silver Blue, another blue. And we'll finish off with um, something else blue, blue stratus. What else? Oh. five ten minutes I'll also put a, a moisturizer on which will be the Nivea men another blue tin all right that's my shave for today please remember it's uh, mesothelioma day and be aware there's not just breast cancers lung cancers out there there are other um, unrecognized, well not rec unrecognized, but um, rarer forms of cancer out there and to uh, please recognize it. Alright, we'll catch you on my next show which should be on Wednesday and we'll see you then. Cheers!